The damper module is used to attenuate rapidly the vibration of the string. It simulates the roll of felt on a piano or harpsichord like we get with this hammer exciter. And when we're using the picked or plucked exciter, it simulates more the finger on the fretboard of a stringed instrument. Now the mass and the stiffness affect how the damper interacts with the string. So we hear the bouncing. Now we can modulate this via key tracking. As I dial this down, we hear the inharmonic effects of the heavier mass on the lower range. And the higher notes are left unaffected. And here's the opposite. Where the low notes are unaffected and the high notes are. And similarly with the stiffness. The high notes are unaffected. And the low notes have the bouncing effect. And here the high notes will be affected. The low notes are unaffected. The gated button is used to control when the damper is applied on the string. Now when it's off, the damper is always present on the string and it affects the vibration. And that's why in this off mode we hear the bouncing with these controls. And then this damping knob affects the ability of the damper to absorb energy from the string. So it's a little shorter. Now let's dial these down, and I'm going to engage gated, and when it's on, the damper is only applied on the string with the note off message, and we receive note off messages as we increase the velocity. This is used to affect the velocity at which the damper is applied and released from the string. So we hear the note off, and this will affect the note off now. And we can modulate this note off effect via key range as well. Here we hear a more pronounced note off on the lower range. And here we hear it more pronounced on the higher range. And then we can combine this with these other effects. And use this to control the amount of bouncing. Welcome to String Studio VS3. 